वेलकम बैक इन टूडेज वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू दिस स्टूडेंट प्रोफाइल मैनेजमेंट सिस्टम यूजिंग गूगल शीट डेटा बेस एंड एप स्क्रिप्ट वेब एप सो हेयर यू कैन सी हेयर ऑन आवर वेब इट इज अ स्टूडेंट प्रोफाइल सिस्टम हेयर यू विल सी द स्टूडेंट नेम एंड द स्टूडेंट रजिस्ट्रेशन नंबर एंड देर एकेडेमिक इंफॉर्मेशन एंड देर पर्सनल इंफॉर्मेशन एंड हेयर इट्स एड्रेसिस एंड देर हिट्स academic history so in this web app we have some uh, options for example first of all we have a log out option login option here we can enter our email and password and click on the login so when we click on the login so you can see here our profile is successfully fetched from our google sheet database so in this uh you already seen the academic information personal information and everything so here you will see a option of change details so you can see here uh we have only new contact number new permanent address and new mailing address uh because uh the all the inf academic information will be managed by the organization and uh, the personal information the name and the father name and the email address is also organized by the organization and the address can be changed through the students time to time and academic history is also organized by admin so the contact number and the permanent address and the mailing address can be changed by the student so here we have a option of change details so you can see here the number is this so i just remove this five and united states one to see uh windsor uh two three four and click on the save when i click on this save so you can see here the data is successfully changed okay and also the permanent address and the mailing address is also changed both in a uh, web app also in our back end google sheet database so now you can see here the address is successfully changed here so the second option in our web app is the change password we can easily change password of our uh, user can easily change their password so i just enter my uh, copy my old password uh, which is the current password and i will just paste it here and i paste the password same here and add only five one more okay and i just paste it here and add five more and click on the save when i am going to click on the save so you can see here password updated successfully so in our database it will also be reflected it will, it will also be changed so when i am going to click on the log out and click on the login so now you can see here invalid email or password so in this case we need to forget password sometime we don't remember the password so we click on this forget password and into here into you into your email here enter your email id okay so you just need to click on this send otp when you click on this send otp the otp is comes because uh, i uh, recently i don't refresh my web app because i am i performed testing so i just refresh it and click on the forget and i just copy this my email from here and click on this send otp when i am going to click on this send otp so now here you can see here the otp comes here uh, we just copy this and uh, also we just copy this and paste it here and uh, the password we have copied from the google drive we will uh, adjust it the here so now here in our database you can see here the password is this uh, now i am going to change to submit it when i am going to submit it so you can see here the password updated successfully okay so now here you can see here the password is successfully updated so i am just going to enter my login details and click on this login so now you can see here i am successfully logged in my google web app so here this is the system you can also change the name from here uh, easily from here and when i am going to click on this log out and click on the login again so you can see uh, my uh, student name is successfully changed and the same thing uh, you can change all the data from here and uh, here's the otp here's the profile picture url here's the uh, here's your uh, academic history of their uh, previous academic history you can see here so this is our student profile management web app uh, what do you think which features we need to add in future please comment below we will add it and make a video for you and uh, how to set up you just need to uh, 
uh, in the description in the description you have a video link how to set up this web app so you can easily set up so remember this uh, in your Google sheet URL bar this is your sheet ID uh, which you just need to replace this and then after that the deployment as same as well uh, as same as we do in our all our previous projects so this our setup is same for all web apps so hope so you like it and uh, take care meet you in the next video love peace